Hi, let's see how to fix the connecting to online services on the battlefield 2042. Are you having trouble trying connecting to con online services in the battlefield 2042? You are not alone. Many players have reported experiencing the issues when trying to connect to the online game server. The full error message reads something like this. Unable to load persistent data, game will return to start menu. Please check your internet connection. Make sure the platform is online. Try again. Okay. So whenever you face this kind of error, you see the screen like this. So let's see how to fix the connecting to online services in the Battle Seat 2022. First method is check your internet connection. Make sure that you have a proper internet connection with very good speed and a very good bandwidth. Okay. So you can check your internet connection speed from this website fast.com. If your internet connection is slow, try restarting your router of the modem. The second method is check the game servers. Another reason why you might be having the issues connecting to the online services is because of the game servers are down. You can check the status of the battlefield 2042 servers by visiting website, official website, EA website. If the servers are down, you will need to wait until they are back up and running. The third method is flush your DNS caches. Flushing your DNS caches can help you to resolve connecting issues. To do this, you have to follow some of the steps. Press the Windows key plus R to open the run dialog box. Press the command and then you can type ipconfig slash flush DNS and then press enter. Wait for the process to complete and then restart your computer. The fourth method is update your game. Make sure that you have the latest version of the game installed. If you are playing on the PC, open the origin client and then check for the updates. If you are playing on a console, check for the updates in the game settings or in the console system settings. The fifth method is disable your firewall or the antivirus. Sometimes your firewall or the antivirus software can interfere with the connecting to the game servers. Try disabling your firewall or the antivirus temporarily to see if that resolves the issue. If it does, make sure to add a game to your firewall or the antivirus exception list. The sixth method is contact the support team. If none of the above troubleshooting steps work for you, you can contact the support team. They will be able to assist you with the solution. Okay. So that's all about this. Thank you.